Do you believe in life after love? Yeah. <laughs> Can y'all believe it? Share 80s culture body mist are in the Dollar Tree for a dollar twenty-five. Okay, Dollar Tree, I see you. Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to Angela's Hauls and Lifestyle. I hope that you guys are having a wonderful day. If you haven't already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I will greatly appreciate that. All right, guys. So today I have a spectacular Sunday Dollar Tree haul for you. I am super excited to be in front of the camera to show you guys some of the amazing finds that I found at the Dollar Tree. All of them were $1.25 each. So without further ado, let's just jump right into it so I can show you what I picked up. All right, so as y'all can see, you can tell I'm still not at home. We are still at the hospital with um, DJ, but he is doing very well. He is making progress. Um, unfortunately, we are still here at the hospital. He's doing very well, but not well enough to go home just yet. Maybe in a few more days or so, we'll see. So yes, he is doing well. I thank you guys so much for your prayers, your thoughts, all of that good stuff. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So yeah, unfortunately, I'm still out of town, but I'm still getting in some Dollar Tree shopping, trying to get these Dollar Tree hauls to you guys whenever I can. So yeah, I went to the Dollar Tree the other day, and I was... Pleasantly surprised, I found some amazing items, y'all. I found a lot of wish list items, some items I've been looking for since last year. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I found some last year wish list items, um, some of this year's wish list items. I've also found some new items that, um, you know, I wasn't expecting to find. So, yeah, I'm going to get into this haul. So... <laughs> This first item, you saw it at the beginning of this video. I was super, super happy to find it. I first saw this on Erica's Dollar Tree Hauls. I think that's her channel name. I'll leave her channel down in the description box below so you guys can go over and check her out because, I mean, she find all of the amazing things, y'all. I mean, I'm like, girl. <laughs> I be like, oh, I want to hang out with you. So I first saw this on her channel. She shared it on a YouTube short. So when I went into the Dollar Tree, I wasn't expecting to see it, but I'm glad I found it. <laughs> so yes, I was so happy. And I think she mentioned there are a couple of these out, but this is the only one that I saw. Um, it just has on the label, Share 80s Culture or Couture um, Body Mist. You get a 6.6 .6 fluid ounce. Um, and it just say on the back, Share Decades, 80s couture features notes of mandarin, honeysuckle, gardenia, and tonka bean. Okay, so those are the notes. Hmm, I never heard of tonka bean. Okay, it says, um, yeah, just spray mist all over your body, just a body mist. Let's see. Oh, yeah, I can smell the honeysuckle. I smell some vanilla as well, but. Okay, that's probably the tonka bean that I'm smelling. Yeah, it smells really good. I can definitely smell the honeysuckle and vanilla. So, yeah, but the notes are mandarin, honeysuckle, gardenia, and tonka bean. Let's see. So, first off, you know, you're going to smell that alcohol. And that's the first ingredient on the ingredients list. So yeah, you definitely get the alcohol, but once that settles down, you get a very nice fragrance. I'm not gonna lie, it, it is a very nice, it's not too overpowering, not too strong or anything, but it smells really, really good. I like it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, it smells really good. Yeah, I'm definitely getting the honeysuckle and the vanilla, but I guess that tonka bean, that's what I'm smelling. 
So yeah, I like it and I would definitely continue to use it. I'm gonna look for the other um, fragrances. Um, but yeah, I hear there's more, but this was the only one that I saw at the store that I went to. Okay, so I got that. And then another find, I was super happy to find this. I saw these on Sweet Sadie J's TV, her channel, she, um, Called these on her channel the other day so I was like oh I hope I find those and I wanted the pink ones and that's the one that I found so these are the Sally Hansen insta dry nail colors but they're the sour patch kids y'all what the Dollar Tree is just showing out y'all they are showing out you see let me take it out of the pack sour patch and I love these little bags you can always reuse these I love those bags. Isn't that a pretty pink? Oh my goodness. This will be so pretty for like Easter, spring, you know, summer months. This is a very pretty color. Sour Patch Kids. Can you see that? OMG, I couldn't believe it. And let's see, this is 767 Pink Punch. And that's def definitely giving a pink punch color. Very, very pretty. I couldn't believe it, Sour Patch. So they had that, I got that one. And then I also got this one here that's like more of a glitter, glitter color, but it's also in that very pretty pink. So I'll definitely be matching these two together. So this one is, is also Sally Hansen Insta Dry Nail Color, Sour Patch Kids. And this is number 761 Trop Pink, like tropical, but it's Trop pink very very pretty but it's um it's more like a glitter it's on the glittery side so i'm definitely gonna pair these two together i feel like that's gonna be really really pretty like do maybe a couple of fingers um i really need to do something with my nails but y'all know dealing with the circumstances i ain't got time to do no hair no nails or none of that i'm not worried about that right now but i'll get to it but yeah i'm definitely gonna be using these um gonna pair these two together yeah like i was saying i'll do a couple of fingers and that glitter and then you know the rest in that uh pink there that is so pretty those are super super cute i was very very happy to find those and then they also had the one in the pride this is the sally hansen insta dry pride so the pride um collection is coming back with some more items in the dollar tree but this time they're coming with some fingernail polish by Sally Hansen. So that's very, very cool. So this is not, you know, the typical color that I would normally go for, but you know, because it was pride, I just had to have it. It's, although it's very pretty, um, this is 733 Unity Galore. I like that name, Unity Galore. So it's in like the brown family. So yeah, this is very pretty. I think you can get away with this for like the summer and fall months. Yeah, it's very pretty. But it's um the Pride from the Pride collection. So yeah, I was a very, very happy to find these little babies. Okay, so I got those. And then next I'm gonna share with you these are very pretty um Easter cards. So this particular store I went to, they had out all of the um like the handmade or what do they call these? Like the I'm not sure the handcrafted cards. Yeah, but they're by the Vola and they're Greenbrier um, International, distributed by Greenbrier International from the Vola. But they're so, so pretty, y'all. These Easter cards are so, so pretty. So the first one I got, um, this one say family owned, open daily, carrot patch, locally grown, freshly picked. Isn't that pretty? Look at that that little um, gingham background and it has like the ribbon and it has like these little gold um, detailing on them. They're so, so pretty. I love these cards. So that's what it looks like on the outside. And on the inside, it just says, sending wishes for a happy Easter and a bright, beautiful spring. Isn't that pretty? That is a gorgeous card. So yeah, I picked up a few to send out, you know, to some friends or whatnot. And then this next one, this is so pretty. This one says Happy Easter on the front, but look at it. Isn't that gorgeous? I'm like, OMG, they really did it with these cards, these Easter cards. So, so pretty. And then on the inside, 
This one just says, thinking of you at Easter and wishing you a bright, beautiful spring. Very, very pretty. Y'all, that share, this stuff smells really good. I can, I, I'm getting that linger. It smells really good. It's not loud or overpowering, but it has a very nice, pleasant scent. I like it. Okay. And then um, this next one, this one says Cottontail Farms with this beautiful glitter truck with the Easter eggs on the back. Isn't that pretty? These cars are beautiful, y'all. Beautiful, beautiful. And on the inside of this one, it just says Easter wishes coming your way. <laughs> That's so pretty. Love that background. So, so pretty. Okay, and then this one, oh, this one is beautiful. I'm going to say this one for last because it's very, very pretty. Okay, this next one says Easter Blessings. I love that lilac or lavender background. That is so, so pretty. Aren't these cars beautiful? They are just gorgeous. Okay, and then on the inside of this one, it says Sending Love, Joy, and Peace During This Easter Season. Gorgeous, gorgeous. They really, really did it with these cars this year. And then last but not least, oh my goodness, this is so pretty. It say he is risen, and you know that's what it's about. He is risen. Amen, amen. Isn't that gorgeous? So, so, so pretty. And on the inside, it reads, may this Easter remind you of the hope and promise of the season. Amen. So, so pretty. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, so those are all of the cards that I got. And then I picked up this. This is new in the Dollar Tree. This glass cleaner, um, and it comes with a concentrated pods starter kit. It's a street-free multi-surface cleaner. It makes two 26-ounce bottles. And it said, look for the three-pack refills in the stores, and those I did find. But this right here, it does come with two concentrated pods. So it comes with the two concentrated pods already, and you get the bottle. And then I also found the refill um, pack, the glass cleaner, concentrated pods, street free, multi-surface cleaner, and you get um, refills three 26 ounce bottles. So you get three refills in this pack and then two cones with it. So in all you get five, so that's more than enough. So yeah, I was super happy to find that. Okay, and then I picked up these. I don't, I don't think I've seen these in any of the local Dollar Trees that I frequent in my area. So I went ahead and picked them up. You never know when you may need a little body shape or pantyhose. So, and I do have a black dress that these will go really well with. So these are the plus size style essentials hangs, body shape or pantyhose. You get one pair and they have the silky sheer leg and sheer toe. These, um, this, this was the only size that they had. 1X, 2X, and black. Yeah, it was the only, it looked like they, oh, these are from CVS. Hmm. Hmm. Wow, that's strange. It has a CVS SKU number on the back. Okay. But yeah, they're at the Dollar Tree for $1.25. Like I said, this was the only size that they had one x to it so i got these the body shape or pantyhose so yeah these will go with that that little mini black dress i got so yeah i got those and then this right here is something that i really really need while i'm here um these socks these are the um, three pair fit shoe sizes five to ten um the licra cool max by peds it's a indulge your feet it has the arch support and these are the cool max brand so I got those and you get three pairs, which is a really good deal for $1.25. So I was super, super happy to find these because I needed some socks. They're very, very bad. <laughs> so I got a pack of those. Okay. Now here's one of the items that I was looking for last year and I'm just now finding it. So this is the household cleaning combo. You get a four piece, take on the toughest job. This right here. I saw this, I saw some of you all hauling these last year sometime. And I looked and I looked and I looked, stayed on a hunt for it, never found it. Forgot I was looking for it until I saw it at this particular store. And it's by the Every Holder brand. It's a Every Holder products out of Anaheim, California. 
in this pack, it comes with one plastic mesh, one coated mesh, and two mesh pads. So I thought that was a really good deal for $1.25. So yeah, I was super, super happy to finally find that. Okay, a couple more items I was looking for last year, and I'm just now finding them. One is the Closet Essentials Handbag Storage. Oh my goodness, I looked and I looked hot and low for this. Never found it until now. So I was super, super happy to find it. The Closet Essentials Handbag Storage. And I think it fits uh, three different bag sizes. Yeah. So yeah, I'll just put it up close so you can see it. But yeah, I was so happy to finally find this. I picked up two because I do have quite a few handbags that I need to, you know, store. So yeah, I got two of those. And then this next item, um, the Closet Essentials 8 Pocket Shoe Organizer. You never see any of this type of stuff in my local Dollar Tree. So I picked up, I should have got two of these. I don't know why I only picked up one, but I only, um... I should have got two, but I I only got one with this haul. If I go back to that store before I leave here, and if they still have them, I'll pick up another one. But yeah, this is the eight pocket shoe organizer. And I definitely needed this because the one that I have at home, um, it has some wear and tear to it. So yeah, that's gonna come in handy. Okay, I also picked up these. Now, they didn't have the panty liners that I like from the Dollar Tree, the ones that are made by Kotex. They didn't have any of those, so I went with these. Um, these are the Sure and Fresh panty liners, regular. They're unscented, um, and you get 40 liners in this pack. I mean, they'll do. The only thing about these, they're super, super tiny. So, yeah, you may have to use about a couple of these, you know, to get a, you know, a good, you know, fit but they're okay as long as they're not you know scented or anything they'll be okay so y'all gotta pack up those and then um hubby saw this and he was like this is a really good razor he said when you can find the ones like these he said that's a good one so um we picked this one up i don't know if he's gonna use it or i may use it to shave my legs or something but it's it's a short for men it's a double edge safety razor um stainless steel handle and it come comes with five double edge blades so he was like this is a really good um razor so we did pick up one of those all right, next, this next item was new to me. These are new in the Dollar Tree. These are the Eco Tools um, little body sponges or bath loopers, whatever you want to call them. But they're by the Eco Tools brand. It's a clean beauty, clean planet. And it has this number on here, 7608. It just says delicate, best for gentle cleansing. It's made with recycled materials, which is really good. So it's plastic free packaging, biodegradable paper vegan and cruelty free so yeah sure it's by eco tools and it has like this little tag that says eco tools so yeah i was very happy to find these i picked up two i got one for dj and one for me so dj can have one to use while he's here at the hospital so yeah i got those and this is the only color that i saw i don't know if they had more colors but at the particular store that I went to, this was the only color that they had. So I did get those two. And then I got some skincare. So I needed some of this um, Witch Hazel Solution because I left mine at home. But I really love this um, solution. I love this what I use to tone my skin. So yeah, this is a really good one. It's by the Lucky Super Soft Witch Hazel Solution. Clean and refresh. It's fragrance free, naturally cleansing. Um, you use it for clarification or clarifying and balancing your skin, and it's for all skin types. You get eight fluid ounces. I absolutely love it. This is a repeat, so I had to get one while I was here because, I, like I said, I left mine at home. So I got that, and I also picked up some cotton rounds. These are the Assured 100% Pure Cotton Rounds, and you get 80 rounds in this pack. So I got those to have here, so I have no excuse to not tone my skin now. <laughs> And then I um I hit some more 
skincare jackpot. Yes, yes, yes. I hit the jackpot on the skincare. So first I found this mask bar brightening biocellulose mask with vitamin B3. It's a illuminating and it contains aloe extract. You only get one complete mask, but it's in a very big package. So yeah, this was new to me. I've never seen this before. Um, it's It has a clean formula. 100% coconut extract is made in Korea, and it's a biocellulose mask. I don't think I've used a biocellulose mask before. Like I said, it's in a very, very big package. Um, and this one, I thought, yeah, I read, you keep this one on for 30 minutes. Usually the ones that I use, it say 15, 20 minutes. This is the first one I've seen where you can have to keep it on. Well, you don't have to, but you get better results if you um, use it as instructed. And this one says keep on for 30 minutes. So I may use this one day while I'm here. You know, when I come back to relax, I may use this with some more of my new skincare that I found, y'all. <laughs> I was super, super happy to find these right here. The Blemish Control by Global Beauty Care. So, yes, they have a new line in the Dollar Tree. And this one is geared towards blemish control. So, I did pick up the, let's see, I'm going to go in order as if I was doing a routine. So, first you get your blemish control or free clarifying cleanser with ceramides, retinol, and blue agave. It's a foaming gel gentle for acne prone skin and you get 2.5 ounces so i did pick up the oil free clarifying cleanser okay then you would go in with your, with your scrub this is the blemish control pore clearing scrub with, with a glycolic acid sugar and papaya Ooh. micro fine exfoliant gentle for acne prone skin and you get 2.5 ounces with this one. So that is the scrub. Okay, and then you have your um, blemish control, blemish and dark spot treatment with vitamin C, azeliac acid, and grapefruit. This is a, a cream gel, and you get 0 0.5 fluid ounces. So yeah, I was super, super happy to find this line. And then last but not least, you have your blemish control or free soothing moisturizer with hyaluronic acid, aloe vera, and cucumber. And it's a cooling gel. You get 1.7 ounces. Awesome, awesome find. Awesome, awesome skincare. Now I know, I, I think it was on Facebook. I may have seen it on Facebook, whereas one of the ladies said that their Global Beauty Care products have moved over to the Dollar Tree Plus and they were selling for like a three dollars and something i can't remember but i got all of mine for a dollar 25 still so don't know okay i showed that already okay and then i found this here this is a two-in-one for a customized base it's for the face it's by the real techniques um this is a miracle mixing sponge for foundation plus complexion enhancers so yeah, I just say mix, apply, and blend. It has a silicone surface texture to mimic your finger, rounded side for blending, pointed tip for targeted coverage, use damp or dry with foundation plus complexion enhancers. So yeah, you can find this brand on Instagram, um, YouTube, Twitter or X, and then Facebook. Or is that Instagram? Yeah. So yeah, that's what the packaging looks like. It's very, very cute packaging. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use this. I don't know if this may end up in a giveaway or a friend mail or something, I don't know. But yeah, that's what the back is looking like. Oh, and that's the front of it. Very, very cute packaging. Not sure where this came from, but it was at the Dollar Tree for $1.25. So I got that. And then they also had these Real Techniques. So this by the same brand, yeah. Real Techniques Sponge. It's a tone plus stimulate. It has new on the little packaging. Um, it's the antimicrobial, so it lasts up to 30 days and then you know, you'll know you swap it out. So it's a miracle skincare sponge with a vegan collagen. Mm. 
Okay. So I did pick up two of these. So I'll definitely be using these. Yes, yes. They're ideal for all skin types. Solution for loss of firmness plus dull skin. Used with toners, serums, and moisturizers. Okay. So yeah, it enhances skin natural glow for even makeup application. So mm -hmm. one month chef life. So after 30 days, you know, you're going to toss this and grab you another one. So I did pick up two. So I thought that was a very, very nice find for $1.25. And then at checkout, y'all, they had these. These look new to me. I've never seen them before, so they're new to me. These are some novelty light projectors um, in the packaging. That's what got me, the packaging. I don't know what it looks like on the inside. Haven't opened it, but I'm going to open it for you all. But this is the package, the box. That's what got me. So I was like, oh, that is cute. They just say place in any room and enjoy cool shapes cascading across your walls and ceiling. It's color changing from red to green and blue, and it requires three AAA batteries that are not included. So you got to have your own batteries. So that's what it looks like on the box, just to show you how it's going to um, project. And then let's look at the actual projector. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, I thought it was going to be a little tiny something, but it's really, really cute. It has a nice little size to it. That's your on and off switch. Put your batteries there. And yeah, that's the projector. So it has like little flowers, little bumblebees, sunshines, um, rainbows, oh, and hearts and diamonds. That is so, so pretty. That is pretty. And I love the colors, like that pink and lime green. So, so pretty. So they had this color. And they had, oh, this is pretty. Look at that purple and pink together. That is pretty. And this one has butterflies, little crowns, castles, and unicorns. These would be really pretty for like your little girl's room. These are so, so pretty. So, so pretty. I'll probably just put these up. Um, put it with like my toy slash doll collection um I, I may keep these or i may donate them you know the end of the year for the uh, christmas toys for tots i'm not sure or i may just keep them and then they had this blue one and this will be like for the little boys oh it has little rockets and spaceships and little robots Little stars. Oh my goodness, it's like a little space theme one. That is pretty. These are so, so pretty. So yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna keep them or donate them, but for now I will be adding to my little collection. Those are really, really pretty. So I got those three, and then last but not least, y'all. Oh my goodness, I was on a hunt. I mean, the thrill of the hunt gets serious, y'all. I'm telling you, it gets so, so serious around here. <laughs> Man, I, now I saw these on Paula MJ's Place walkthrough. I don't know if she was aware of it. You know, she was just showing her little toys or whatnot, little cars in her walkthrough. And I was like, and my eyes went, ding! <laughs> when I saw that Indiana Jones, I was like, I gotta find it. I've always been a Harrison Ford uh, fan, I love, I haven't watched all of his movies, and I ain't gonna lie to y'all, I haven't watched them all, but one of my favorites is Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Y'all, I don't watch that movie probably a million times. Oh my goodness, that was like one of my favorite, favorite movies. So, y'all know I had to find it. Now, I found these at two separate stores. One store, they only had one. I was like, Derek, cause Derek was with me. I said, they, I, they had it. I said, it was the last one, the only one. I said, it was for me. <laughs> he was like, okay, calm down. <laughs> so then we went to another store and he found it was the last one, the only one. He found that one. I was like, do you think I should get both? He was like, yeah, why not? So I, I got both of them, y'all. 
So I got the last one that was at one store. I'm sorry, 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 but not sorry. And I got the last one that was at the other store that I went to. And this is the Matchbox Indiana Jones. You see Harrison Ford in that corner there? <laughs> <laughs> and this is the 1936 Auburn, Auburn Speedster 851. I was so, so happy to find these, y'all. So, so happy. So happy to find the one that I found, the first one. Then hubby found another one. So, yeah, I'm super, super excited about this. Very, very happy. Yes, I'm keeping them both. No, I ain't going to be selfish. I may donate one. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I feel bad if I don't, but oh my goodness. We'll see. We shall see. But I was so, so happy to find the Indiana Jones Matchbox 1936 Auburn Speedster 851. Yes. <laughs> All right, guys, and that is it for this Dollar Tree haul. As always, I thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope that you spotted something you would like to try yourself. If this is your first time watching and you enjoy this type of content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it if you give this video a big thumbs up. Comment something down below, and don't forget to ring the notification bell so that you're notified each time I upload a new video. And as always, I am now signing off, sending positive vibes, and wishing you many, many blessings. Hope to see you on the next one. Bye!